What are you doing in about an hour? I don't know what I'm doing. Do you want yeah. to make some gains? Why not? I think we should. Okay. Good. Right, let's go. Puppy dog. Look at your little eyes. You look so happy, don't you? Yeah. Okay, hello. How we doing, people? What's up, guys? Liam here, and welcome back to LSJ TV. Let me stick you up here in the best position that I can. I'm not used to this. How are we doing? Hope you are all good. Let me just set my sat nav up here real quick. Hold on. I've just dropped Charlotte and her mum off. I am playing taxi service tonight, so this is this is me for the night. <laughs> so I wanted today's video to um, serve a purpose. I wanted today's video to just be something that I've wanted to make for a while. There's a few videos kind of like this that I've been wanting to make for a while. This is one of them in particular. Um, and that is my 2020 goals. Normally I like to kind of get this up around the beginning of December, but it's been busy. It's been busy, you know, I'm a busy guy. I can't, and I just forgot. <laughs> been too busy making those full days of eating, eh? Hmm. Anyway, um, so today's video is gonna be my 2020 goals, um, literally in numbers, what I want, whether it be in the gym, whether it be social media, or just life in general. Um, Today's video is going to explain a lot. I'm going to be splitting it up into categories, or if you're American, categories, and uh, <laughs> who understands that reference? Let me know in the comments. And I'm going to try and make it fun. I'm not going to try to be boring, you know, just sit here and tell you, in 2020, I want to achieve this, this, and this. Like, you know, I'm going to try and put a bit of context and a bit of story behind it. So, without further ado, people, drop the video a like if you have not already. Let me know if you notice any kind of different changes. Some people will know, very few people will know what I'm talking about. And yeah, it's going to be a good one. I'm excited to make this, I've been wanting to make this for a while. So, like, comment, share, subscribe, together we will grow. Thank you for tuning in today, people. Let's get it started! So, I need to put my sat-nav on. Head northwest on Aldridge Road. Okay, Head will do, thank you. Lane. Let's turn this off because I'm driving. Hey, someone told me, is it, tr is it true that that's complete BS? You're not allowed to drive with this light on. Apparently that rule is complete BS and you can do what the hell you want when you drive or oh, not what the hell you want but it's not against the rules to to against the law to not have it on to have it off it's not against the rule to have it on wait like I could drive like this and although it's not ideal for me personally it's not illegal I don't know if you know the legitimate laws behind that then let me know in the comments but um Let's start off today's video, shall we? With goal number one. I'm gonna be splitting this up into three categories. One is life, one is kind of professional life, and one is um, social media kind of goals, you know? So, goal number one in life is to, <laughs> I have one goal, is to be happy. 
is to enjoy my life, is to, okay, thank you, is to just continue doing what I'm doing because I am happy with how things are right now. I am content, if you like, with my, my progress in, in life and uh, my, my progress in life is not linear, you know, it's not like your typical person's progress. You know, I, I actually hate the whole, you go to school, you go to college, you go to uni, you get your job, you die. I hate that, I really, really hate that and so I'm glad that my life is not like that. And so, I essentially want to just continue the way I am, as, as, as simple as that sounds and as silly as that might sound, but I'm happy. So, why would I try and change that? Intentionally, you know. Where the hell are they? Get those boxes of the four. Um, I only have a single one dinner one. You might be thinking, Liam, it's dark. Why the hell are you picking up monsters at this time? I'm not drinking them now. They're for the next couple of days. I'm going to be at Charlotte's for the next couple of days, so I pick myself up a monster for each day, basically, and that's it. One pound forty though, Tesco, sort yourselves out, people. You know why though, don't you? Because you've still got idiots like me that will bloody pay for it, that's why. I, I asked the guy, after I couldn't find them in there, I was like, where are your big boxes of, oh, you slipped down, hold on. I was like, where are your big boxes of, of monsters? It's like, we only do the single ones in the monsters. I was kind of like, well, you've not, because I always buy a box of four from here. You've just ran out, like, anyway. pound forty per monster. Bargain, really, when you think about it, hey. Hello. Oh, big stretch, everybody. Humans. Hello, humans. Hello, humans. Here and sit. And down. Good boy, and then to a sit. And pour. Clever boy. So next up, let's move on to probably the one that you all want to hear, um, is my social media goals. I have specific numbers that I would like to hit, um, and well, yeah, it would just be good um, to, to hit those numbers on, on, on social media, you know, with the amount of work I put in, I feel like I, I can hit this, um, but they are striving high, you know, the, but there's no point striving low, you know, what, what, what's the freaking point in that? Anyway, YouTube, currently at one second, as of today, Friday the 27th of December, we are on... 2,024 subscribers, we are hitting... 13.9k views per month and an average of 53.9k watch time minutes so that will probably mean not an awful lot to a lot of you guys but that's just for me to kind of personally look back on um i would like to double the subscriber rate is is essentially what i go for i always say i want to go for double what i have so last year i said i think i had 2.2k on instagram and i was like right i want five i think i had 1.2k or something and I was like right I want 2.5 on on YouTube um that hasn't happened but you know you can never predict YouTube growth I could have 10k by the end of tomorrow if I have a video go friggin nuts you just cannot predict YouTube in particular Instagram is a little bit more regimented I find but YouTube you just you know you could go up 10 in a day but then go up one in the next three and it just you know, it just doesn't make any sense but anyway YouTube is the wonderful weird and wonderful game that I love the most so that is the one that I would like to focus on the most going into um, 2020. No, no real change there. But anyway, we would like to hit 5k on YouTube. Um, just a nice round number. You know, we recently hit two, so that is double and then a little bit more striving above. Just hit 5k on Instagram as well. So I would like to hit 10k so I can finally do the friggin' swipe up. That would help me a lot with my protein. Just working with other businesses as well. Having that swipe up feature is very attractive to to uh, businesses, to working with companies like MyProtein, like Muscle Food, stuff that I've done in the past. I would like to strengthen those those relationships within 2020 as well because that kind of ties into the third category, my, my personal professional goals, if you like. Um, I would like to start monetizing my social media a little bit more. I would like to start making a bit more money from it. You know, I, I make a bit. Now I'm with my protein and now, you know, I, I make commission on things. I make YouTube views money and stuff. 
but not enough to quit the day job. And I would like it to be the day job, you know. So I need to increase the 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 what's the word revenue, the cash flow, should we say, um, in order to to make it. So, you know, but that's not going to happen overnight and I'm very aware of that. I always say it takes seven years to build a YouTube channel and we're like four years into it. So, you know, three years, <laughs> we're right there. Anyway, you get the point. So we would like to double everything with a little bit more. So I suppose I should aim for slightly above 10K, but I think 10K is a very doable number on, on Instagram anyway and five on um, YouTube. In terms of new social media platforms, a lot of you guys, I want to hear your thoughts on this, right? Uh, I really I need some advice because I personally do not like this platform that I'm about to talk about. Where can I put you? I'll just put you back down here, sod it. I personally, at this point in time, do not like TikTok. I don't enjoy it. I, I scroll through myself, but I don't see it as a, I don't see how I can leverage it to, to help my social media, if that makes sense. Help my, my business, if you like. I don't, I don't know how that can help me and I'm trying to figure out a way that it can help me, if that makes sense. Once I do figure that out, um, I'm going to start an account. I'm going to start, hello, I'm going to start uploading, uh, Sorry, this is Charlotte, she wants me to pick her up, so. Once I have figured out how I can use it properly, um, I would like to use it properly, you know? I, I actually don't understand the app. I don't know how it works, I don't know how hashtags work on it, I don't know how you create content for it. So I need to do a bit of research, but within 2020, I would like to start an account and start posting on it, you know? Because I think if you don't keep up with the trends when you do stuff like me, you're just asking to be left behind. It's as simple as that. And so I'm going to make an account, start uploading regularly, maybe, I don't know, one little thing a day or every other day or something like that. Because Instagram, I try to do every day uh, with the occasional day in between, where, you know, give people a rest from my pretty face. But um, yeah, I, I would like to start a TikTok and, you know, start uploading to that consistently and i suppose to round off the um the 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 social media goals um i would like to uh, right okay this is one thing i was speaking to um a friend of mine a good friend of mine about this the other day my instagram following has gone up um substantially in the past two to three months kind of in the run-up to my protein and just after my protein had a little kind of spike um, since then, because, which is natural, you know, I can produce my protein content, people get attracted to that and then subscribe and follow, all of that kind of stuff. But I feel like the content I'm producing is way better, way, way better than it ever has been. Um, and that's because I've practiced it and I've practiced it and I've practiced it over and over and over again That's just what I preach if you want to master something just do it and do it and do it and eventually you will get good at it I feel like I have made great progress with creating content the videos I make now I, f I feel I mean I'll look back at this in a year's time and think god the videos you made were horrendous But I feel like the videos I make now in comparison to this time last year are a lot better And I hope that I can say the exact same at the end of next year at this time next year, you know um, and so I would like to keep posting quality content. I don't want to post just for the sake of it. I want to post quality content, a high quantity, but also quality. So every day on Instagram, Wednesday, Sunday, with as many in between as always. You guys already know that. If you're new here, I upload every Wednesday and every Sunday, and then pretty much as often as I can in between. But for the last three to four months, I have done an average of three to four videos a week but bar this week like that's literally been it um so i produce as much content as i possibly can because i see every single video that you make as a lottery ticket a lottery ticket to one that could explode a lottery ticket that could be seen by the right person um and that's literally all it takes in this game guys it's literally all it takes so i'm just going to keep doing what i'm doing and i have faith that it will work out in the long run because if you don't believe in yourself then who the fuck else is gonna you know what i mean so I have faith that I can make something of this and I know that with your guys' help we really, really can make something special in 2020. I've got a good, very, very good feeling that it's going to be a good year for, for the whole social media game, you know? Let's make it our year, okay? What? I'm coming! 
Right, I best get going guys. I hope you have enjoyed this video um, and let me know your thoughts. Should I have specific gym goal numbers? I might make an entire separate video on that. Um, in terms of the gym, I would just like to improve body composition, essentially. That's that's it in a nutshell. But um, I hope you have enjoyed this video. Let me know your thoughts on it down below in the comment section. I'm going to get to editing it. Oh, no way. I need to taxi. I need to be taxi service, don't I? <laughs> if you have enjoyed this video, guys, please do me a massive favour. Drop it a like. Comment down below. Subscribe if you are new. I don't want to sound cliche, but I'm looking forward to levelling it up in, in the new year. I know that... I have so much more exciting ideas to, to still share with you guys. I've shared just a teeny tiny amount. You remember that long list that I've got? We've got a lot to get through. I hope you all had a very Merry Christmas and a Happy New Year. Thank you very much for watching. Together, we will grow. And I will see you in the next one, which is New Year's Day. I'll see you in 2020. Oh, my God. Okay, cool.